So guys, we are back with another Elden Ring video, and in this video, guys, I'm going to showcase to you how you can get this Druid Bokeh Talisman, where it raises attack power when summoned spirit dies. Basically, guys, get yourself your very own guinea pig in battle. When it gets taken out, you get a damage buff. Today, guys, I'll showcase to you the location of where this thing is found. We're going to test this thing to see how much of a damage buff you get, how long it lasts, and much more. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so this dried bouquet or bouquet talisman raises attack power when a spirit you have summoned has died. So, sounds pretty cool and I'm thinking a lot of people like myself do use those summons within those boss battles to make it a little easier. When that summon does eventually die, you get a damage boost could be a good thing to go with so let's test it and see exactly how much we get now i've taken off everything else in regards to what's going to give me a damage buff we just got the dried bouquet on so hopefully i can actually get a kill because it's quite hard in this area uh, so i'm just right here guys just going to find our enemy and try and quickly calculate exactly how much of a damage buff we're going to get i've put on also a weak spirit i haven't leveled up so hopefully it should die quick too hello guy come and have a look at me there we go. So let's just go with a normal attack. 613. Okay, so let me just summon you. And hopefully they attack him. And he doesn't kill them, because that would be awkward. Come on, take him out. Stop focusing on me. I'm also going to count and calculate how long it takes. I think I've got a slight idea. Go on. There we go. There we go. Chop him up. There we go. Go on. Take him out. Take him out. Okay, so I'm down. So there's my buff. Okay, so let's do a normal little attack. See how much it goes up to. 735. So that's quick maths. 20%. And I'm thinking this is lasting about 20 seconds. Get out of it. Get out of it. So yeah, the buff does last about 20 seconds. That's something I already tested. I thought it was 15, but I think it is 20 seconds. So yeah, not bad whatsoever. So you get a 20% damage buff for 20 seconds. That's pretty cool. You can do a lot of damage in a boss fight or any fight uh, for that matter. So yeah, so where this is located. So first of the guys you want to come to this point on the map right here. So if you haven't got these two graces unlocked, you need to come from uh, the three path cross, make your way around main gate, you can't really miss it and you'll eventually come to these two uh, settlements right here so you want to come to this small private altar if you haven't got that on yet, you know what we'll run from here, just in case just in case people, you never know I like to make guides proper uh, I don't just want to throw random graces there where people may not have them unlocked but this grace you can't really miss so yeah, you'll, event you'll come from them steps and it's right there so this, way, this is the way you want to go Hopefully, I don't get slapped on my way. And that would be awkward too. There's a hard hitting enemy right there. Ignore him. And as soon as you come up through these streets, guys, you're going to get fired down from the balcony up there. And there's enemies to your right. Just try and dodge out the way of all that. And the enemies will be chasing me. There we go. And look how hard he hits. So, yeah. You run past him. Another guy there. And you want to take this door to your left. Dodging. And this is that grace we just pointed out. So, yeah, not far. So yeah, I'm just going to sit down and get my health back. Okay, so from here, come through this door. Let's wait at these steps a minute so that guy doesn't clock you and just take knock your lights out. Then come down this way. And then guys, you just want to jump up on this rubble and make your way across these roof paths. Use a quicker route that way, but hey, there's a chance that enemy might see you. Then guys, just dodge right here and then jump up on here and then jump over so you miss those two enemies down there that you would have to run past and they're quite sneaky then go to this ladder get up it as quickly as possible and we are good so now come out here and go up just like so now take a left come down here and now there's more rubble to your right you want to jump on this and you want to go over and be careful around here there's some mutant fly that grabs you, so yeah, be careful there. There's a few more here, just run past them, you should be good now. And then guys, once you've uh, activated or interacted with that cross, come to this door, 
on your left hand side we have exactly where this tal talisman so is found and there you have it guys that's how you get this amazing talisman known as like i said the dried okay raises attack power when summon spirit dies pretty cool guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one